Uh, this exoskeleton helps patients in uh, rehabilitation after a stroke. What this means is that uh, the patient can wear it, but the, uh, uh, the medical professional uh, that is going to help them can define what the movements, what the resistance is going to be, and then he can let the patient work by himself. What changes with robotics is that one doctor can do many patients at the same time, and one doctor can treat patients remotely using different exoskeletons. For now, we are able to bring the robot with a first level of artificial intelligence into the market, and that is something that we're going to do in the short term. So what this means is, right now, we're doing clinical trials in several countries, and we are ready to enter the market and, uh, uh, with uh, this solution. The next versions of these uh, robots are going to be more and more intelligent as we collectively learn how to certify AI with robots so that they are safe. Jelajahi cara baru mendapatkan informasi. Download Metro TV Extend sekarang.